We're going to be learning how to add some sound recordings to our spaces, either as a background recording or we could have it so if your audience clicks something, then the sound recording plays. So first of all, I'm going to go to Upload and I'm going to upload a sound recording. And you'll see here, you've got the option to record it directly into CoSpaces or I use the sound recorder on my laptop and you'll see here I actually recorded it three times because I tried it in a few different ways and then I chose the best one so maybe you'd like to have a go at doing that once it's uploaded if you click on these three dots you can just set it as the background and that sound recording will play in the background but I like making my spaces a bit more interactive so I'm going to actually get my unicorn to speak and I'm going to give some direction to my audience so click me I can talk in fact, I'm going to change that to click me once, because if they double click, then the sound recording is going to play over and over. And instead of rearing up, I'm going to have my unicorn nice and calm, so in a neutral position. And I'm going to turn it on in Coblox, because I'm going to program this unicorn, and I need to have the option of program it. So you must turn it on in Coblox, and make sure you remember its name. And here I am, just editing, as I said, I would click me once. So, we're now going to go over to Coblox, and I'm going to start a new Coblox script. And I should have renamed it Unicorn, but I forgot. And we go over to the events, and when something is clicked, that is going to be the event that starts things. So it did say Casual Boy, but I've changed it to Unicorn. If you can't find Unicorn there, or the object that you're trying to program, make sure you've turned it on. Click on, Double click on the object, go to Coblox, and using Coblox. Here, I've got the sound, and I'm going to make that true. Now let's test it. So when I click on it once... Welcome to Shartin Junior School's very own virtual art gallery. Yeah, it does work. Fantastic. So there you have it. You've got the option of recording a sound recording and then uploading to CoSpaces, or you can record it directly into CoSpaces, and then once you've recorded it, you can either have it as a background soundtrack or you can make it a bit more interactive and get your audience to click on something and so it will play only once they click. Up to you. And now it's your turn. So, you're going to make a recording and you're going to upload it if it's not already in CoSpaces and then I'd like you to choose the object that's going to be clicked and add instructions so your audience knows what they have to do and then you're going to have to do some programming in CoBlox. Make a new script, add an event, Add the sound and then test it. Make sure as the audience it works. Good luck.